All right, let's add the fractions 1 5th plus 3 fourths. Here's how you do it. When we're adding fractions, we want to end up having our denominator to be the same. So we want to have the same denominator because then we can just add the numerators together, keep the denominator the same, and we'll find the sum for 1 5th plus 3 fourths. Probably the easiest way to do this is take 5 and multiply it by 4, like this. And then over here, we're going to multiply 4 times 5. 4 times 5 is 20. We've got 4 times 5, these 20. So we have the denominators the same. They're both 20. But we can't just multiply the denominators. We also need to multiply the numerator. So let's put 4 times 1 as our numerator. And that works because 4 divided by 4, it's just 1. We're multiplying 1 fifth by 1. We don't change the value, just the way it's represented. Over here, since we have 5, let's do 5 over 5. This is, again, 5 over 5 is 1. So 3 fourths times 1, it's still 3 fourths, same value, just we'll change the denominator to 20. 4 times 1 is 4. 4 times 5 is 20. Over here, 3 times 5 is 15. 4 times 5 is 20. So now we have the same denominators, we just add the numerators. 4 plus 15, that equals 19. Bring the 20 across since we're adding fractions, and 1 fifth plus 3 fourths equals 19 twentieths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.